Hey folks, it's Bobo the Vulture. And the Mysterious JG. And it's time for a Mondo More Muso mode, mother mothers. The Musos. Yes. Musos. Speaking of Musos, what character have you got lined up? <laughs> Muso mode might make sense. I don't know. You know, I feel like we've done the uh, the sort of the son of the shoe family, or the Wu Kingdom, the shoes. Maybe it's time to go this way. Not this way. You go with patches here. Uh -huh. You go with uh, the incredibly strong great axe, John Way. He carries around the attack times two power up all the time wherever That's he the goes. Guy, um, I don't know if it will be posted yet, but he's the guy who was super impressed uh, in that one mission where we were yes. playing. Yes. <laughs> oh, I'm in hell. <laughs> I really think that was incredible. Anyway. Yes, that guy's a lot of fun. Plays Mr. Serious. <laughs> yes, plays Mr. Serious. You can play as. Ah, I forget whoever that is. Um, Jiao Yuan, he's the guy that has like a million cavalry and is about to, uh, Get yeah. Get kicked by Guan Yu, yeah. Yeah, I recall that. Well, I mean, that's in a... That's right, folks. Go over to Mysterious JG's channel now and check out the, uh, the... the, the Romance the, the, yeah, Romance of the Three Kingdoms 11, right? His weapon appears to be a stud of top of some kind. Oh, no. <laughs> but, uh, got he's Jang, got lightning quick raids. He's got Jang Liao, who has, like, kind of an interesting... You know, hat. <laughs> yes. It's also a really powerful warrior. There's Sima Yi, the intelligent boy, the black swan to uh, Juge Leon's white swan. Right. So, uh, he constantly looks forward to the day that he may rule the land himself and be master of his own domain. We have Zhu Huang, aka Helicopter Man. <laughs> He's the guy that arrives, right? Yes, he arrives. A lot. And there's Zhang Yi. Uh, he also comes sometimes. Oh. He, uh, but yeah, he is Vega. For some reason. <laughs> yeah, for some reason. <laughs> he's, he's, gonna, he's, he's on a secret mission to get Lu Zhu to defect his way. Zhenji, you yeah. may have seen her at the uh, at the conclusion of Soon Jian's Muso mode. Uh, she is the first Attacks character. with the power of jazz. Of all the female characters they threw into the game, she's the first one who really has no business being in the game because she just doesn't really matter in the novel. But she is their best effort they've come up with to prevent Wei from being a total sausage fest. Kao Ren, he's a guy with a shield. <laughs> that's, yeah. that's his story. He talks like uh, Jet Black, so we got that to look forward to if we ever try him out. That's how P is the most, like the best manager ever. He really knows how to empower his employees. Yeah, he's great at human resources. Um, yeah. And he's got a new serial coming out called uh, Cow Pee Pebbles. Yeah, it's Cow Pee Pebbles. Yeah. Probably not going to be very good. Then there's Autobot Bang Day here. Uh, apparently so called because it appears that he's like has this little like. Transformer helmet here that's he looks going like on there. Many faces. Like if you hit the button on his back, that, that face that will, that turn will like within turn within his helmet. I thought it was like a little knob face. on top of his like, it, but head. But yeah, like you turn it around, and then you know. And of course, if uh, you're a child that is of the age that you're getting uh, <laughs> He-Man toys, you're going to call him Manny Feces. <laughs> I mean, it's just going to happen. Now, the cool thing about playing Day of the Novel is that at one point he goes to battle against Guan Yu's army with a coffin strapped over his back. And he says that one of us is going to end up in this coffin. And it's him who ends up in the coffin, but it's still supremely badass. The cool That's thing about Pang Day in this game is that, you know, he looks like a lot of us. <laughs> so in the book, he's just he's the undertaker, basically. He's like, <laughs> oh, I challenge you to a casket match. <laughs> I hadn't thought about it that way, but indeed, he really should have Paul Bearer falling around. <laughs> But uh, yeah, then we got patches wait, again. Did, did he skip anybody? Oh. oh wait, who's this guy? He's an able minister in times of peace and a hero in times of chaos. He's also known as kind of an ass. <laughs> I mean. Yeah, yeah. No, he's like he's he's you know. And then Zhuge Liang is like written to be like sort of like strategic fire attack using version of Jesus. Cao Cao is pretty much the. Uh, he's pretty clearly the guy who deserves to win because he's just so much smarter than everybody else. Yeah. And uh, he's also known uh, by Larry I hate you as uh, Kao Kao. <laughs> Kao Kao. Kao Kao. So yes, this is Kao Kao, Cao Cao, Pebbles, and I'll sometimes Kao Kao. Yeah. And uh, I mean, look at—I mean, he's got a—he's got a silent movie villain mustache. <laughs> I mean, clearly he's so, supposed you know, to be a If you look at this screen, three of the four characters have. Silent movie villain. I mean, he does not have the most silent movie. Well, villain I mean, Zhao Yuan. He's got a yeah, like. Right. No, look at Jang Liao. But Jang Liao he's, definitely. He is yeah. silent movie mustache. Plus, Cao Cao's out he of is snidely whiplash with a turban on for some reason. No, that's yeah. You can call him Cao Cao. Or you can call him Cao Cao. Just don't call him late for dinner, folks, because he'll kill you. Yes. And he has a tiny head. 
He does. Oh man, I almost forgot about the fact that he has the tiniest hat in the land. It's cow cow. Wow, yeah. Like father, like son. Oh, I am cow cow. Bitches. As of now, the people across the land are suffering, and the glory of the Han Imperial Court has faded. The land is doomed to chaos. I love it. The land is doomed to chaos. So hey, why not be the guy that's dooming it? <laughs> <laughs> it's not Tao Tao's fault. No, it's not. The world of chaos is like a living hell. However, beyond the chaos lies a new world. I must follow my ambitions and create a new land of my own design. It's kind of like a real-life version of anyone who's playing like SimCity. Yeah, I was about <laughs> to say, like, I'm going to drop water on these inclines so that I can build hydroelectric dams later and not have to replace them periodically. Oh no, a non-copyright version of Godzilla is attacking. <laughs> because I cheated too many times. Uh, yes. The world of chaos is like a living hell, and of course, he, uh, as Liu Bei and Sun Jian did before him, will probably end up having the living hell of being living dead at some point during this Musa. Cow Cow, um... Yeah, he's around for most of his Musa mode, but he does kind of look pissed about just everything, doesn't he? Now, you know, we were making fun before about Lu Jun plugging his eyebrows and stuff. Like, here, that might actually be in order. <laughs> just like a little trim, nothing, you know, yeah, like... Yeah, yeah, yeah. First, I must join the campaign against the Yellow Turbans who are plaguing really? the Really? The Yellow Turban Rebellion? Let us go. This is to be the first step on my path to conquest. I was getting a phone call, probably from Tsao Tsao, telling him to stop making fun of his eyebrows. Yeah. Actually, hang on, folks. I'll be right back. So, yeah. Sorry about that, folks. Uh, duty calls. Yeah. <laughs> I said duty. Yeah, that was, in fact, Tsao Tsao uh, calling from beyond the grave to defend his eyebrows. <laughs> yes. And he said, I better not even think about mentioning the goatee. And I just sort of chortled because that wasn't where I was going next. Psst. It was going to be the hat. <laughs> but... <laughs> Leave Britney alone. Oh. Hey, Jean. Hey, Jean. I will be commanding the army for the battle against the Yellow Turbans. Those of you who have come to fight on behalf of the Han, the gratitude of your emperor is with you. Whatever <laughs> emperor you have. <laughs> yeah. You're, not, you're nothing but a goddamn coward. You, deserve, you don't deserve to be in this place of honor. We are now heading to Ji to Jean. take out Zhang Xiao, the leader of the Yellow Turbans, who is holed up in their main base. They research Burrow. It is said that Zhang Zhao and his brothers can control the elements. Yes. <laughs> Who keeps saying this? If we take his brothers out, Haven't they heard the mad burns the JG has yeah. been giving them? Alright. Prepare to go to battle. For the glory of the Han! Han! Alright. There's still a chance to save, man. I feel like we've seen this before, too. A little bit uh, of deja vu. Oh. <laughs> yeah, but now we actually have a far cooler intro. For like our person. Well, yeah. First of all, we end the intro, and second of all, we're just more badass. Liu Bei's personally killed that peasant. But his to come, little pointy so boots. The chaos of the land has spread this far. Pretty much spread to the place we came to to fight the chaos. <laughs> A world at war. You can't kill me. Nothing can kill me. Looks so pleased with himself. Yep. I'm one of the three big leaders too. Yes, he is. Where's my Undertaker panda? Let's go. Once we bring an end to the chaos, this land will be ours. Should I play as the guy on the left or the guy on the right? I'm thinking, if, you, if those are your only choices, the guy on the left. Right. Okay, folks, Bobo is stepping around to see. We, it's not going to show up on the recording, but we're having a little bit of a visual. It, it might, actually. It might. Oh, well, that's no good. But, uh, you know, I'll give you the once over the Wave Warriors here. We got Patches, who's famous for having an eye patch. So also, he's a pretty badass general. Career follower Tsao Tsao, I believe he was his cousin, because I don't know how that works. Tsao Tsao was 
according to some sources, was actually born into the Jihao family, but was adopted by someone named Sal. Either way, he and the Jihao's pretty tight. John Wei is some big, bald, kind of generic strong guy, dude. Zhu Zhu is um, the alarm alarmingly generic in a certain J-pop series. Big retarded guy. <laughs> Uh, you got another Shi Hao. Shi Hao in the house. Yep. Got a Zhang Liao. Yes, there is our silent movie villain. Yes, he's actually one of the more complicated and uh, interesting characters in the novel, but he has become a silent movie villain for the game. Yeah. We have the Black Swan. We have Helicopter Man again. We've already gone through all this. Yeah, we've gone through really Vega. See yeah. the true prettiness of Zhang Hei here. That's Zhen Chi is pretty cute. You know, I wouldn't kick her out of bed for any crackers for she, you know, a real person and not um, from several hundred years ago. Yeah. But Zhang Hei is clearly prettier than that. <laughs> got Kao Ren, who's kind of a loser in the book, but becomes important in the games. Sao Fi, ditto, actually he's kind of a loser too. And Autobot Pang Day. I'm going <laughs> to go with the best. Now, the way the story is told in the book, it seems pretty badass, but no, I hadn't actually heard me that that is a very Undertaker thing to do. <laughs> I <laughs> come to this the, ring with a casket. Except, of course, for the fact that he lost. That pretty much doesn't happen to Undertaker. Yeah. Jihao Dune is on the scene. Actually, I, <laughs> at least with Buried Alive matches, I kind of thought the Undertaker had a bad record with them. It's well, sort of weird that he would keep doing them, but yeah, you might be right. I may be crazy, but yeah. So do I really need my defense up? Oh, I might you switch want. to that later, but for right now, let's uh, let's just kill stuff with incredible speed. Oh, there you go. And my bodyguard will be yours. No, that's yours. Not that it matters, but um. But yes, we're going with the feathery we're going ones, with the folks. Feathery, yeah, we've, we've got various daughters of Soon Jin are gonna help us out here. Do you wanna flip yourself? Yeah, I do wanna flip myself. Let's first of all, let's see what kind of weapon I have. I had a broadsword. That's good. Got kind of a generic set. Yeah, jazz move set. All right, I have no horse. I have no orb. Yeah, what are the don't orbs? Serve, no country, don't serve, no country. Don't They um. They lend like certain attack attributes to your charge attacks. Like the fire ones uh, cause damage over time, the ice one freezes, the wind one is like, I think it breaks blocks, and then, I don't know what all do. But it doesn't matter because we don't have any of them, so. Alright. Well, cool. Let's uh, check out what's going on here. Agent is leading the hunt forces towards the Yellow Turban base in G. The target is the Yellow Turban leader, Zhang Jia. If he is defeated, then the Yellow Turban will crumble. If Zhang Jia and his brothers are using sorcery to attack our forces, they must be stopped at all costs. It would be best to defeat them quickly and secure their halter before they can do too much damage. I can dig that. Can you dig it? Well, I've seen well, this pretty much of, yeah. many, many times, but uh, so I sort of know what's going on. You got the big three leaders, you got Hei Jin. Over here you got Zhang Zhao and his brothers, you got Zhang Man yeah, Chang's gonna receive the power. Yeah, and Hei Yi's hanging around up here waiting to ambush you if you're not paying attention. But it's an ambush only in the sense that you might not see him coming, not that, you know, plot events will trigger. Yeah. And uh, I have a feeling we'll probably be able to win this match. We have a chance to win this. We do have a chance to win this. So yeah, is this looking any better now? Or? Yeah, it's looks better. Oh. Must have had a loose wire or something, folks. Zhang Jiao has unexpectedly become the leader of the times. I have become a weird what? man. So, Cow Cow, what role do you envision will be yours to play in this time of chaos? Apparently I'm going to trip balls and I'm see not, some I'm weird not, old dude. I'm not Are sure, you? Grandma. I am known as Zuo Chi, and I am still waiting to hear your answer. Kid! Cow Cow, lead your army Kyo. east! Soon Jian, you attack the center. Meanwhile, this force of volunteers will head around yeah, to the You're getting a head start on me. Although you missed this box. And I got I Stop them! You got a good good sense Truly you are the hero of the hero of chaos. You have an item and everything. You just launched flaming explosions. Yes, I did. All right, you appear to have this. Congratulations, my lord! You have achieved a kill. <laughs> Not that Cao Cao is really known for wandering out into battle and just engaging forces on foot. Behold the mystic ways of the yellow turban. Pretty awesome. Oh, God of the wind. Yes. 
come and prevent these foolish beasts from fouling your air. Oh, man, nah, it's not the same guy. It's not it's the not guy, guy that does the, the, the sleep things. Rise and blow them away. With your fantastic special effects. Rise black, you do. No, he's not Panda. Aim for the one controlling the wind. Aim for the ones cutting one. That's yeah. yeah. I know you were really surprised to hear one of those. Oh no! It's here comes the story of the hurricane. Yeah, I actually did something. An officer, huh? Hey, I defeated an officer. I have yet to do that. I gotta admit. Oh, hey there, buddy. I'm surprised I couldn't see that thing coming. I do have two good eyes, after all. Yes, you're, uh... Fighting sure is easy when you've got two eyes. <laughs> Somebody's bodyguard is already near death. Oh, I really should have set mine on defensive, I guess. I want to put mine on defensive, but I think it's yours who's in trouble. What are you... I don't know. I don't know how he's going. Ah. Oh crap! Punish the foolish eaters. No, give it food. Oh, I feel the power in my own hands. Get back here, you coward! Damn it! Just the victim. Ah! Of stealing your kills. Yeah, that life. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> I got the item. The item was. You shared. also got the weapon. I thought. This ought to give those in the face a good scare. I got the weapon from killing the officer. Dude. I didn't kill the officer, dude. Though. Yeah, I know. Kill a different officer. <laughs> but you did take the. My lord, enjoy this weapon. Open your eyes and serve the will of heaven. What happened to my soldiers? Man. Bewitched. What happened to me? I used to be a badass. Now I can't do shit. Is it because I'm being controlled by the computer? Could be. Sir John's unit's morale is dropping because you know he's just he's just not feeling he's just not feeling right. You know. I will defend my lord Sao Tsao from defeating officers without my help. Do not fear. The spell will break if we cut off its source. So uh, cut the cables that lead to the spell generator. Yeah, but do I cut the blue wire or the green wire? Don't worry, we don't have explosives yet. <laughs> Oh, I actually, thought we, we like had gunpowder, man. Lot of explosives in this game. I'm trying to go safe for the Sun John. Lord South Sass cut up a few kills. It sucks. This couldn't go any better if I lost an eye somehow. Although that's yeah. a strange thing. <laughs> <laughs> yes, and that, that you would think that that would make things go better. <laughs> Yeah, they're actually telling Sao Tso that he's out too far. Sao Tso known for charging his army and by himself. He's attacking. He's like, you made fun of my eyebrows! My ambition cannot be stopped. My ambition has the bushiest eyebrows ever. Yeah, that's right. Excellent work. You would be my true friend. We're BFFs, Lube. Where's your boss? Who are you working for? Oh, Sun Jing's okay. Yeah! I can't think of anything interesting to say, so I'm just gonna mumble and go here. Yeah, but Yellow Turban uh, Rebellion, um, I'm sort of running out of things to say about this. <laughs> um, we, we got air that's been fouled, that's pretty cool. Hey, there's Zhang Yan. Hey, Zhang Yan, no fair blocking. Ooh. 
<laughs> oh, darn it. I've been hardly training. Whoa. You've been training hard. You've been training hard. <laughs> Listen, I don't think you understood what I was saying. There we go. This guy. Do the way. Everybody, me. after me. Woo. Oh. With these infidels! They're jerks, each and every one of them. It's like ignoring our allies in Charlie's Street and Disney GI. I don't know, it's a critical strategy, of course. I'm, I'm planning on doubling back around once I've cleared the path here. And now that we have showing up beyond Jang. Yeah. He didn't even get a chance to say, I'm going to attack you. Hey ye. No. We shall rebuild the land and do away with these foolish these remnants guys really of the land. These guys are the yellow turbans or yellow headband dudes. Like Look, to there's going to be a lot of money to have to like get all the cloth necessary to put a turban on all these yes. guys, so... And like they're not weirded out by their ghost troop allies, I mean... No. It's like they're fighting for Sue Johnson, right? You should know who you're dealing with. You're dead, shut up. I won't be denied next time. Just another big ball. Some kind of device producing these phantoms. I think I'm Is there no alternate? Oh, I'm thinking of Destiny, but there is no alter here. Chang Man Shanks having a bad day. Cause like I'm here with the entire Wu army juggling him. I must retreat. For now, my ambition cannot be stopped. It's about time I face the worthy opponent. Just, Just another. His ambition can. Yes, he is Taz. <laughs> Came out of Red Hook to mess you guys. You may be able to take away my eye, but you'll never take away the ECW title. <laughs> Unless you buy the company. Trip me of it, yeah. Oh, my God. That's what my guys should be doing right now, McDrops. <laughs> That's how it's supposed to be done. Keep doing that. That's basically what I'm saying. Come on. There we go. Got an item. So now everybody except Liu Bei's army is being successful in Liu Bei's army is going to Yeah, and I'm wondering whether or not I should bother going back to help out Liu Bei's army. Well, I'm going to take care of the one. Oh, you're over there already. Well, then you're done. Oh, well, I suppose then shall I just move on and take out the Invincible Army? I think you might as well. I mean, I did a lot of John jacking before the battle started. So this is probably going to be a full length video, even if we don't oh, yeah, take a no. ton of time on this. Uh... That's a pretty cool way to get an officer. Alright, gotta get up here to where the altar is, and hopefully that will just go. No, Zhang Xiao, I'm not actually interested in dealing with you right now. I just want to find the, uh, the altar yeah, like, where all the crazy dudes are. Yeah, okay, there's nothing except that. We mustn't let there them are steal regular our troops glory. in the Ube's way, but there's no plot points. Heaven has called for the creation of a new world. But no, as a member of the teachers' union, I'm going to go on strike. If we can secure collective bargaining rights. Please, that oppose us. That's pretty much South Tao's whole thing. So, um, what, uh, collective guy. bargaining rights? I like. opposing rights. I mean, he's not he he's not He Man, the demon who defies yeah, heaven. Man. One of these videos I have to describe He Man the Devil defies heaven. Oh, 
it should probably be this one. He was a like, Ah, uh, there's the grail that has the invincible dudes in it. So it doesn't actually contain invincible dudes, but... What? Their morale is dropping because he called us villains. Oh yes, sir. Watch me go. <laughs> hey, Jin really does inspire and break you know, faith in his troops here with his, you know, yelling of blood. He's like, hey, fight, fight them, do stuff. Ah, stand around back here, you guys. But anyway, folks, there's a point in the novel where Cao Cao sends uh, his armies out to fight bandits, and um, one of the bandits rides out. He's described as having like a, a yellow turban on his head and a green jacket. A spear. They describe it. The characters don't often get great in the description. But they describe this guy. It's, uh, he delivers the following line. I am He-Man, the devil who defies heaven. Who dares test me? Then one of Cao Cao's generals who didn't make it into Dynasty Warriors rides out and kills the guy with the green blood. <laughs> it's probably my favorite part. <laughs> I am he the devil. So, I must retreat. The devil who defies kills him. My ambition cannot be stopped. Rud. That is how it's supposed to be done. Stay away from Toso. Get off my boy. Right. I just I'm low on health now. Oh, there's Bojang. Yeah. Cow Cow is no soon John. Just back off. I am backing off. I mean I'm being chased by Zhang Xiao. Well great now Wu's hanging out with me. I think I might just join with see that fun, guys. Some battles you win, and some battles you lose. My ambition cannot be stopped. You guys are going to up against this guy. Prepare to attack! Follow me! Oh, really? Is that what you think we should be doing? Thanks. Thank you for healing me up a little bit. Oh, you found him. Yeah, I suppose I probably should be using my Muso token at this point. <laughs> yeah! Da! And he was your 450th opponent. Oh. Everybody Sao have Sao a look up, folks. Sao Tzu and Chiao doing souls won't be the same either. That guy had a horse. <laughs> I didn't see who it was. It looked like it might have been Su John, but. Uh, Check it out, folks. <laughs> Put a delicate hand up to the sky to the check for rain. Xiao has been defeated, yep. along with his lies. No, his lies, uh, they, they survived. They're really tough. Is too many. As commander, I would like to thank you all for your service. But I'm kind of busy. <laughs> yeah, I got places to go. I want all of you to return to your homes and continue to loyally serve the Han. What about those of us who weren't serving the Han? The land never again sees such chaos. I want you to do that, but I know, Gao Gao, you're pretty much not going to. <laughs> Nope. Well, oh, that is an upgrade. Oh, we got two upgrades yeah. of the Seven Star Sash. Whoa! I think it was being discarded. Yeah. Oh, yeah Switch scroll. Tiger and all that. Really long build to soil the phone. <laughs> all right. Yeah, so, the names yeah. are so long. They're completely exact. You just defeated Chang Yuan Zi Huang Chong. And, and Bei Yuan Chao Hei Yi. And Boche. But not the big guy. Uh, if it makes you feel any better, if you go back and watch the video, I killed him in a pretty awesome way. <laughs> but I a <laughs> yeah, there we go. I didn't kill as many dudes, but I killed all three of the Jangs yeah. and Jang Man Chang. I think you might have actually killed more of like regular guys, like because you got 450 like it was chaos, close. right? We were pretty close to that whole battle, but yeah, yeah. I, I basically defeated the closest this thing has to plot generals are the are Zhang Liao and Zhang Liang, Zhang Bao, and Zhang Jiao. Jang Man Chang. 
Because Zhang Man Chang always is not receives the power. Zhang Man Chang is not. I don't he's know like a brother called. cousin or something. No, I, I don't think he's related to them. I think it's a coincidence. Zhang is apparently a uh, Chinese for a smith. Yeah. That's a nice civet. That's a great civet. Great. That one's not so great. Yeah, sorry. Okay, scimitar. <laughs> and we got some books of striking. That's pretty cool. So let's save the game here. All right, let's save over soon. John being all clear. Yes, let's overwrite the previous data. Keep going. Yeah. So when we come back next time, folks, hopefully uh, we'll be doing something different than the Yellow Turban Rebellion. Well, yeah, I imagine we'll be doing something different. I have a feeling I know what's next. And, and it's also one you've seen, but hey. Well, you know. After are we gonna are we gonna face a uh, a certain general of Dong Joe's that's completely indestructible and Yeah, I was getting a little cocky being Soon John and like, hey, I got this move set down pretty well. I bet I could give Lu Bu a run for his might. Not so much with Cow Cow here. This is Coco Pebbles is not doing as well for me. He's but not, uh, he's not awful. Thing, but uh, you do have to engage Lubu at least once to trigger a cinema, and then after that, you can haul ass out of there, probably. Yeah. But anyway, we'll deal with that in the next video, folks. Yep, this is Bobo the Vulture. And I'm Sirius And I thank you very much for watching. See you next time.